Dufflings, it's Nico, and ooh, just in the top, wants to do its own thing right now, sorry about that, I got, <laughs> I got glitter in, glitter, so, yeah, I do have, uh, access to the, uh, these, but these are just regular glitters. So, I mean, it's, it's not anything other than regular glitters, and it's not all of the colors. And I ordered these last week, and, well, thankfully, I got one package in last week. So, or this week, I got one package in two days ago, so I could finish up the unicorn horn. This one's been adopted. What did I call these? Wish bottles? Yeah. These are really cute, really, really cute. I really am in love with them. But they have like, I guess what's classified as specialty glitter or like uh, slightly smaller confettis, things like that. I don't know, cut out glitter, glitter and shapes. This one has pumpkins and stars. What does the other one have? This one has pumpkins and different stars. It has green stars. Uh, but yes, also, like I said, I don't have access to all of the glitter color spectrum. Like, I don't have black, I don't have pink, I don't have purple. Now, oh, it has some glitters. And I figured it would be fun to open these and share them with you. So, and I got some glitter last weekend. Just, like, as backup glitter in case everything that I ordered didn't come in. So, I shared the, the glitter I got at Target, which is the backup glitter, with you during live chat. Okay. Oh. I love bottles. I love glass bottles. These bottles are better uh, than another one that I had opened, but these are not glass. These are plastic, and yeah, that's good for, like, dropping and stuff. At least these are better quality bottles, but I got a Tutti Fruity Fruit Slices mix because all of my fruit slice canes are in Florida, and we're doing fruit dragons. So my next one I'm planning on doing is lemon. I'm just in a lemony, citrusy mood. So those are cute. And then snowflakes because my snowflakes are in Florida. And these are just fun. I love them. Anyway, I'm starting to do wintry things. That was all that was in this bag. Let's do this bag. I've got three different bags. Actually, ooh, excuse me, the bag I got in earlier this week was also a different bag. And I'm still missing one thing. Oh, I don't, oh, my other bag. I gotta save that packing slip. Okay. A single oh I didn't think this one was gonna be here today all right so these are iridescent unicorns how freaking awesome is that they're so pretty okay that's really I like that it's from the brand recollections um, I know Michael's craft sells it oh that's really pretty my next unicorn horn wish bottle will have at least two maybe three of these we'll see how much room it takes um, because I want everything to have a chance of being seen in the bottle. So that was all that was in that one. Let me, let me move this for the packing slip because I need to save that in my receipt file. I don't know what the heck is on top of that, but mm. let's open. This one feels heavy. I like supply hauls. I like watching people open their crafting supplies and their first impressions and I just figured this is going to be fun because I love glitter. You guys know I love glitter. I like the sparkle sparkle, the shimmy shiny and that's what this looks like. Ugh. Ooh, that's, a, that's a good size shipping box. <laughs> that's so sad but that is how I think of things. That, do I need to save that box to ship? Wow. It looks like glitter exploded in here. Oh no. Oh, there is. I don't think you'll be able to see. There is, there is fine purple glitter. 
all over the place. So let me grab a towel. All right, this is the container. Like I got a pack like this earlier in the week and I don't like these containers. I think they are cheap and some of the lids don't close. And for the brand and stuff, I expected better containers. I mean, these are plastic containers. This is a snow mix. What What is the name of this mix? Christmas. That's a Christmas mix. Um, it doesn't have the title of the mix. Anyway, we have iridescent snowflakes and blue glitter chunks and uh, like iridescent and light blue glitter chunks and a fine baby blue glitter. Those are really pretty. So we got that. Ew, whatever was on the top of that box was on my hand. Oh, I didn't even notice. Okay. This is the one that exploded. You can see the explosions. Which is a little... It's very annoying. But it's a little weird because there's supposed to be a seal on top of each of these to prevent this from happening. But this is a Halloween mix. Uh, with this beautiful fuchsia purple... Uh, green, it's a nice green, I don't have that green, uh, stars with like little centers cut out, and black, which is, oh, it's a black and fuchsia blend. Oh, oh lord. Well, I had to christen my work area one way or another, might as well be glitter, right? I'm, I'm not even going to bother opening that. Next, we have this I got specifically to go on top of my cupcake charms, even though the charms for the, it sounds so cool, um, sounds like a maraca, like a baby maraca, or a baby rattle. Anyway, I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted, but the charms for the spoopy odds and ends adoption, um, were already done, and I knew I wouldn't get these in time. These are for future charms, they are just little iridescent boobles. Little boobles, little pearls. They also come in like a mix. So I think it's a blue, a pink, and the white all mixed together. And it looks cool, but they also have a pink one and a blue one. And I'm probably going to end up getting that. But I can use iridescent for everything because I don't have my fine little tiny itty bitty pearls that I use as sprinkles up here. Da 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 da! Done! This was only like 99 cents or $1.99, but it is more snowy glitter. We have silver snowflakes and blue snowflakes and just some, yeah. It's just, it's obvious, just more glitter. Lord above, that purple is, it's gotten everything. I now have craft herpes. If you don't know, that's what people call glitter, the herpes of the craft world. Because once it goes on something, you can never get it off, ever. This is really nice. It's really fine. And I don't have these particular, well, I think I have it in the mix now, like the bottle mix, but I don't have like these particular shades of blue. Or this silver. The silver that I showed you is more of a holographic silver. <laughs> Ugh. All right, one more, and then I'll show you the stuff that I got again. Ooh, this is another Christmas mix. I'm only saying Christmas, even if you don't, like, subscribe to that holiday. It's fine. I, I grew up calling it Christmas. But this is, and it's also called a Christmas right there. But this is a really nice green. Don't have that green. These are, gr it's not Christmas trees. These are Christmas trees. This is just a sort of like circles and it has a little like pink and gold mixed in. That's nice. That's fun. And then this is a gold, just chunky monkey thing. But these trees are really cute. I like all of them. It's why I got it. There was a red Christmas mix that I almost picked up, but there was no like specialty shape, no particular cutout shape. So. Okay. This bag is, is going to end up being my regular garbage bag. I have like a recycle bag and a regular garbage bag. And that'll be a garbage bag. 
This is where I put my glitters. So far, I'm probably just gonna keep them there till we get the shelves and everything set up. Shelves are still like right there. All right, these is, oop, there's four of them. This is the Halloween mix I got in this week. Got some nice orange, did not have an orange. Just gonna put it back in the box. We got some yellow and orange stars, that's fun. And this is holographic black spiders. I mean, this blew my mind when I saw it. Because, like, in the picture online, it was just black spiders. So these are freaking holographic. Amazing. And this is, like, a really nice uh, witchy pumpkin. It's, like, orange and purple and black mix. I used it in this one. It's in there. And these little wish bottles can definitely be shaken. And you can, you can move things around. You can have it sitting on side, however you want. Anyway, so that's what I got there. And then the bottles that I got at Target, which honestly, I'm probably, whenever I see these at Target, I'm probably just going to buy the set. It's a set of four. These are greenish yellow stars. Um, I want to say they skew more towards like a light green color. But they're fun. I use those. These are the pumpkins. So fun. These are uh, iridescent, just circle cutouts. I had, I used it in the bat jar. Sorry, I like glitter. And last but not least, these are purple hexagons. Yeah, it's a stop shine cheap, so it's a hexagon. Um, but that's, that's the glitter I got. For the moment, I am planning on having, like, I'm gonna have a total of nine shelves. I'll have four shelves on one wall, four shelves on the other wall, and then a shelf up, um, above my desk. And the one above my desk will theoretically have my plant, because I'm, I'm gonna hopefully get a plant. Maybe this weekend, maybe next weekend, I don't know when. I'm planning on getting a plant, so I'm, I think it's gonna be a spider plant. Easy to keep, pet friendly, cat friendly. Um, but I'll have a lot of storage shelves, and I think I'm going to keep the glitter on the shelf, if not a drawer. The drawer things, the three drawer, plastic drawer, like starlight drawers and stuff, they're out of stock nearly everywhere. Um, I don't know why. Probably because of the virus and production, and everything is like being... It's just showing that in the stores that like it's not there and it's just not there at any of the stores right now um unless you want to pay like two and three times the price so that's not that's not going to happen for me but I will eventually get storage drawers for under the desk area and around either side of my desk and I don't I don't know where the glitter is going to go I really think they're beautiful so I'm going to have to open those but I'll put them I'll put them away but I want to have them displayed because I really like them. I just wish the quality of the bottles was like glass and nice. I mean, these are okay plastic bottles, honestly, and definitely reusable. But but these bottles, these are just trash. I don't, I'm so not, I'm disenchanted with this style bottle, honestly. And I have to tape this one because it won't, it won't stay closed. It's just, it's just trash, not happy. But anyway. I've got, I've got glitters. I want to, let me, let me open the unicorn. Oh, it's sealed, which is good. I'm always waiting for the day that I do that and I miss, because I do miss some days and I know I'm not always looking like where I'm supposed to at the camera. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't, I didn't know. Let me, let me see. Come here. Come here, you beauty. Ooh, this is, it's so magical. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. I love it. It's a really, it's a really nice white iridescent color. Yes, that's really nice. I'm very happy with, with this unicorn. I'm actually really happy with the cane slices. Uh, these are also polymer cane slices. I suck at caning and I am more than willing to admit that caning is making canes is not 
my strong point, so I'm not going to do it. I just, I'm not, no. Alright, that's, that's what I got. I figured it'd be fun to share, uh, ooh, you can't really see. Glitters, that's anticlimactic. It's alright, different, excuse me, different glitters. Fun stuff, lots of fun. Now I gotta try and not make a mess when I open this. This scares me. Uh, uh, the lid probably got loose and popped. The lid, these little plastic lids, they don't even screw on. They just, they pop on and off. So, anyway, well, one exploded glitter out of all of the ones I got, I don't think is very bad. Okay. I'm going to go back to monitoring the this and that odds and ends, whatever, whatever I decide. I think it was an odds and ends adoption. Yes. Yes, I'm going to do that. Thank you so much for everybody who has adopted stuff right now. I am so grateful and so appreciative. You have no idea. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, also, I am going to be participating in... Uh, Laura Jane's Laura's Lair, Simply Critters. There we go. Laura Jane is her, her pen name because she writes books. And Lori is her, her normal name. She's in the Grove. And Simply Critters is her polymer clay artist page. She just, she does so many things. She's doing a Halloween adoption next week. I'm making a limited edition flower pot dragon specifically for that adoption. So I have the flower pot done. I have to make the dragon tonight. Sculptober has started. I am doing that. I'm trying to do everything for this weekend. So for like at least Saturday and Sunday. Because I'm not going to be working. I'll be spending the day with Kevin. Yay. Um... So I got to do that and take the pictures and edit those Sculptober pictures. And yeah. Oh, got to remember to do invoices. Invoicing has just been, uh, like sometimes I wait till the end of the adoption and do everybody's invoice. And sometimes I just do it like that night and I keep it up each night. I think it just depends on how exhausted I am emotionally. And I know that sounds weird, but Karen burp squad excuse me caring for elderly parents and and living with three other people is it's very emotionally draining so i'm just i'm just doing it as i do it all right elflings i love you i hope you like this rambly glitter filled video i want to work with the glitter now but i gotta wait um i will talk to you later and um stay safe and stay healthy Bye. I love you guys.